Hello everybody, welcome back to Evolve. We're going to be playing as Kraken today. Kraken, or Kraken, however you want to pronounce it. Uh, let's go... we'll go Bog, because we're on a bit of a foresty map. Uh, we're against Rogue Val, Hank, Maggie and Torvald. Don't really know what to make of that composition, to be honest. I don't think I've ever seen this composition. Um, that's probably a lie, I've probably seen that. The amount I've been playing this game, but yeah, don't know actually. Torvald's uh, he's quite easier to dodge with Kraken with his mortars, so we might be all right here. I think it is default Hank and not Tech Sergeant Hank. Tech Sergeant Hank's usually weaker than Hank, so we'll have to see. Probably going to be focusing um, Hank a lot in this one. And also, he does. Uh, Rogue Val does actually break the beam team because she doesn't actually. Uh, she can't actually heal directly. She provides an aura instead. So we shall see. We've got turrets around the map in this one. We'll just get rid of that so we get through. Should be fine. First bit of food. Because I went the wrong way. <laughs> Just gonna got the uh, the corpses from the top. I think it's fine. We have found McDonald's, so we're gonna chow down in here quite a lot until they show up anyway, and then we'll move on. That's very annoying. That's fine. One of them just spawned out of the corpse. That confused me then for a second. Where is it? Can't see it there. Oh, this is a bad situation. We're gonna get out right away, pray that the trapper isn't right there. Oh, that's fine. Bot's actually going for the cutoffs. Sometimes forget that, you know, with it being bots, the Usually you expect them to be quite fucking shit, but they actually know what they're doing in this game. And they will actually attempt cut-offs like that, so... That's an old binary. So we'll get cooldown reductions off this guy. Um, that's a health regen buff on the, uh, the Tyrant, so... I could do without them going across there and killing it, but... You know, we can't stop everything. Is that an Alberta? Oh, it is. Alright, okay, we'll take movement speed then. Might be a bit more beneficial this actually because Kraken is sort of slow by default, honestly. Want us to go that. This will be our stage two though, so we'll go and promptly move up in the world. Just to be on this rock. We should have enough distance at this point. Do it. I think we've got quite a massive distance to be honest actually. Uh, that'll do. Beautiful stuff, there it is. Entered our teen years. Let's go straight into this because they're going to be here any second though. to get into our first engage here now. Wherever they may be, there they are. Sprinkle a couple of them in there. Just trying to... I've got like two shots on Daisy and about 50 I just find. So we'll go for Maggie straight away. He's just burned his orbital on that armor done, which is very unwise. Oh, it's actually the defense buff. Which I do want to deny him from getting because it's going to cause us a lot of issues, we're going to have to go for Hank and he is away from the buff which means if anybody wants that it's going to be free but I'm going to have to do this so he hasn't got the Armadon buff at the minute either so we can actually capitalise on this got no abilities at the minute getting there there's some sweet directional animations there 
Kraken does possess them as well. Did actually creep that damage in there, which is nice. We'll go for your uh, hang again. I need to get out of the way of that turret though. I kind of need to. Ah, oh, shit, she used her ability. That's Rogue Val's um, main ability. She can give herself like a second life. So basically a full health heal. It has quite a. It's not a very long cooldown, but it's long enough that you can kill her before she can use it again. As she makes a liar out of me there, that's because I, I was focusing Hank um, instead of going straight for her. She basically forces you in a fight to, you know, kill her twice basically. Otherwise she will be able to keep getting it. Uh, we'll grab some more here before we go in again. Sure, right now. We'll go for this again, try and push him off there maybe. We did actually push him off there, let's get some of this in there, I whiffed that. Try and get an aftershock. We did get an aftershock, she did heal it though. We need to go for Hank again here. We get the Hank down as quickly as possible before the shield uh, the dome comes down. There you go. So now she's got no way to shield, there you go. And we'll go straight for Maggie. We'll be able to fight through Val's um, healing. Tell a lie, actually. Uh, Rogue Val does actually have beams. They're just not as strong. I just remembered it's the one that chains to uh, teammates. She does possess an aura of healing, so she passively heals a team for those that are around her. There it is. Uh, we'll get out because I'm out of health now. Um, and yeah, we'll go and grab stage three. I think we've done enough damage to this team though, we should be alright now I think. That's me fucking spazzing. Alright, we'll just get it here. There we go. The tallest man in the game is more or less the biggest monster. Behemoth is just wider. This man is absolutely huge and he sounds it, as you can hear. Ooh, nice. It's actually going to take us here, more or less. Uh, since it's running out, I will take the damage buff. We're about to lose the speed one anyway, so... There we go. So we'll grab this. I'll eat it all just to deny it. We'll go say hi as a giga damage squid. Please land. It's hilarious getting something to look out <laughs> the distance on it. <laughs> you did it the uh, the tower there though, it was a bit unfortunate. Look at the distance on that man. It's so good. Some directional animations there. I always like to get them off. I try to attack people at weird angles because it's still the monsters have a, an answer for it. Every time. Just trying to tag the turret and Maggie there. We'll uh, get in here. Get Daisy down. I think she gets her ability actually. No, she doesn't get down there. <laughs> uh, we did actually deny that, which is nice. Aftershock should down her. Beautiful. I don't know if I can actually. No, a bit too slow for that. She's gonna get nuked though. Big damage on there from him. He is quite a high damage uh, assault Torvald, but no, we did it. Quite a quick one at the end there. Beautiful stuff. As I say, I I, thinking about that, I think Vanilla Val and Hank is actually better than Rogue Val and Hank. 
because I, 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 I mean, I don't pay attention to like numbers specifically, but I think Rogue Val's healing via beam is slightly less than default Val, so she, she sort of offsets it with her passive aura healing. But it's from from my perspective, it comes off as a bit weaker, honestly, when you can just have a highly concentrated beam heal them instead. But you know, it's what it is. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, give us a comment, give us a like, you know, subs, all that sort of thing. Do tell me you're enjoying. I love hearing the comments and all that. And yeah, hopefully I'll see you for the next one. Bye.